The United Nations says over 260,000 people have been forced to flee their homes in the Gaza Strip as heavy Israeli bombardments from the air, land and sea continue to hit the Palestinian enclave. First fighting has left thousands dead on both sides since Hamas launched a surprise assault on Saturday, which has led to Israel's reprisal bombing campaign. More than a thousand people have been killed in Israel in the worst attack in the country's 75-year history, while Gaza officials have reported 900 people killed since the airstrikes began. The United Nations Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs, OCHA, while citing Palestinian authorities, said the bombing campaign has destroyed more than 1,000 housing units and 560 have been so severely damaged they are uninhabitable. It added that among the displaced, nearly 175,500 people sought shelter in 88 schools run by the UN agency supporting Palestinian refugees, UNRWA. Israel has imposed what it called a complete siege on the already blockaded Gaza Strip, cutting off food, water, fuel and electricity, a move that UN Secretary General Antony Guterres warned would worsen an already dire humanitarian situation.